A magnitude 6.5 earthquake has struck the central Philippines, Ooh, killing morning, a powerful earthquake hitting the Philippines in the middle of the night. There At are least eight people have been killed after a magnitude 6.1 earthquake struck the Philippines. People in the... Philippines, a tropical country which is one of many countries that is included in the Pacific Ring of Fire. Good day everyone. Today, we will be tackling about the precautionary measures before, during, and after an earthquake. Make sure to prepare the things you need, such as a fire extinguisher, first aid kit, a battery-powered radio, flashlight, and extra batteries at home. Don't leave heavy objects in the shelves because they'll fall during the earthquake and it might hurt you. The most basic rule you learned in our school is duck, cover, and hold wherever you are during an earthquake. This can prevent high risk of hurting or injuring your hands and other parts of your body. Stay calm. If indoors, stay indoors. Stand against the wall, near the center of the building, and stand on the doorway or crawl under a heavy furniture, such as a desk or a table. Stay away from windows and outside doors. They could break and cut you. If you're outdoors, stay in the open away from power lines or anything that might fall. Stay away from big buildings and structures. Don't use matches, candles, or any flame. Broken gas lines and fire don't mix. Use emergency exit, escalators and stairways instead of elevators. They'll get stuck. Check water, gas, and electric lines for damage. If any are damaged, shut off the valves. Check for the smell of gas. If you smell it, open all the windows and doors and leave immediately and report it to the authorities. Stay away from beaches. Tsunamis sometimes hit after the ground has stopped shaking. If you're at school, follow the emergency plan or instructions of the person in charge. Lastly, pray and expect aftershocks. Be always prepared. Humanao ka Jesus.